Bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> no. Time for bladder check. Check. So it's a show? It's a lifestyle. It's a religion. <laughs> My emotions! My emotions! I'm still French. Ouais, c'est pas faux. I'm a woman, Mary. I can be as contrary as I choose. Non, moi je crois qu'il faut que vous arrêtiez d'essayer de dire des trucs. Hello, hi, I'm Laura. I'm gonna watch House of the Dragon season 2, episode 5. If you want to see my reaction videos about the first episodes of the season 2, about all of the season 1 also, you can find them into the eye, you know, with the playlist that I made for House of the Dragon and you can find all of my reaction videos into the chronological order and I'm gonna put the link also for the previous episode in case you're just interested to see my reactions to the last episode and to Rainy's death. Is it truly a surprise for you guys, like if you are following me, if you are watching my reaction videos, to say that I'm still sad about her death? I'm still surprised that I didn't cry much more than how much I cried because I cried but uh, really I thought that her death would make me cry more maybe because we saw it coming we saw her coming back into the fight and really she's my queen and since a long time and really right there she proved that she was a true queen and she was the soldier you know that she, she's like the vibe that she went back into the fight knowing that she would die and just she went back into it because in time of war you can't give up it's not possible and rather it was the first big fight so she couldn't give up and and just retreat like that she had to come back and to maybe you know bet on luck and find a little opportunity to do something good even if she knew because she has that experience that it was surely already over and dead for her and then when her dragon died and when she let her you know fall herself you know fall like that that was awful but at least she had a good death you know an honorable death she died being loyal to Rhaenyra until the end she was loyal to Rhaenyra to her side to that fight you know to that cause if I can say it like that and she she was really like that as a woman and all independent and free you know with what she was saying with what she was choosing to do to be also I loved her so much and you know it's a little weird because now I'm really like with whom am, am I gonna connect that much into this show? I love all of the characters and that also some people can't understand it, the fact that I really love all of them and I'm really supporting all of them. Rhaenyra like Alicent and I know that Alicent has a lot of hate against her and I'm not sure that I understand why because like Rhaenyra she has big qualities that I admire but she has also defaults that I'm against with, you know? I can see also that Alicent, she has qualities and she has also defaults and clearly I can see both of their reasons, you know, to act and the fact that right now we're into that war, they are both responsible for it, not only Alicent, like really, all of these characters, I appreciate them, I love them, I'm ruling for them, maybe not Damon, like Damon, I love his character and the development of his character and during this season he has such an interesting you know, pass and all, and I think that we didn't see all of it. So it's gonna be cool to, to know more about him, what he's gonna do and all, like, that's gonna be interesting. But I'm not ruling for him. <laughs> and it has been a long time, you know, that I'm not ruling for him. Like, for example, his relationship with Rhaenyra, I was against it during the season one, it didn't change. For sure, at some point, they had me a little because they were sweet together, but I never forgot the fact that same family, an older man with a teenager, the power situation, the control situation on the, the teenager, that ambition thing, you know, about ah, maybe you're a little interest also by her position and all. And when, you know, he began to talk louder than her, to also molest her a little, you know, push her a little and all, I was like, hmm, that's it, now I don't have the patience anymore with you and uh, you can be sweet sometimes, but it's not enough anymore for me to, to just be okay with your relationship being like that. 
So I was glad, you know, when Rini Rush, she faced him and she told him what I think, you know, in fact, and what she thinks now and she sings it out loud. So I was glad about it. So yes, I don't support him for that, also for what he's trying to do now, like clearly these new allies, what you want to do with them and all, it's clearly for yourself, so I don't approve that neither, someone being disloyal, betraying Renira and all, after all of what he did before. So yes, I love his character for how he's written, for the evolution that he's gonna have and I want to keep him as long as we can. But I'm not supporting him. When I love all of the other ones and I'm supporting them, like for example, even Aemond, I'm supporting him. Even if he killed my queen, I'm still like, I still love his character. I'm still supporting his character because I can see his reasons to act. I can see his qualities and his defaults. I can see, I can see him, you know, truly. But Renis was really the one with whom I connected that much, so now I have no one. No, now I'm really like, no. There is no one with whom I'm really just like, oh, I love you, each time that you're on screen, like, I love you so much. No, I have no one anymore like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this fight being done with Renis dying, that was something, but we had also a major event that happened during this fight which is gonna be in fact more important with more consequences than Rainy's death, Aegon's death. Aegon's death and because of Aemon, like, are they gonna say it, that he caused it, that he chose to to sacrifice his own king to go against Rainy's? You can do that with a soldier, you can be like, okay, I can sacrifice a soldier just to have my bigger enemy. But your enemy, your king, no, like <laughs> you have to to up for another moment into the fight during which you can attack only your enemy and not you know put the life of your king at risk, even if it was not supposed to be there, no matter what is your king. So normally they all saw that. Are they gonna say it or not? That's another question. Aegon, the king is dead, so now like it's gonna be really interesting to see who is gonna be the next king. Aemon, Tra, Alicent, uh, as a queen, both. The kids, you know, the boy is dead, so you know, I'm really wondering who is gonna have the throne now. And I think that it's good for the Targaryen side because the High Towers, they're gonna spend some time, you know, and they can have some internal conflicts. Because of that, you know, because the king died, so who is going to take the throne after him? I think that it can take some time. And it can create some conflict inside of this side, so it can be good for the Targaryens. And for sure them, they lost Rhaenys. But even if I loved her so much, I know that she was just one of their allies, one of their soldiers, and... Yes, it's not going to change things. I mean, maybe his husband is not gonna be happy about it and you know he had something against Rhaenyra before so maybe now he's gonna be a, a little more against her? Ah, I didn't think about it. About Carlis, you know, and how he's gonna take the situation. Oh. <laughs> now that I think about it, maybe it's not gonna be great in fact for you also. But that fight was truly great. I really think that it can fight with all of the other fights that we had into Game of Thrones, which were great, like, I felt it, I really felt it. Okay, let's go for this episode, remember that if you want to have my Patreon on which you can have this episode earlier, one day sooner, you have a longer reaction part with the level 2, at least 10 minutes longer, or the full reaction part with the level 3. It's the best way to support me on my Patreon if you want and if you can. You can subscribe just for one month if you're only interested by Out of the Dragon. You can subscribe for more than that. And if you want, you can subscribe for the entire year and think about it. You're gonna have one month offered. And right now, I'm organizing a crowdfunding because clearly I'm a little reactor on YouTube and on Patreon. So I need to begin a second activity into my life, you know, so to help me at the beginning, I need to, to open that crowdfunding. So you can find the links to my Patreon and to that crowdfunding 
on the description and really like it's two ways to help me one you have something in exchange and one it's just you know a little support that you can give me a little extra support that you can give me if you want and if you can don't put yourself into any difficulty believe me i know the situation right now how hard and difficult it can be you know just to fill your fridge believe me i know about it so it's just if you want and if you can let's go for this episode oh and a fair warning Outside it's beginning to rain, so maybe at some point it's gonna rain a lot and it's gonna be a little disturbing for the sound. I'm sorry for that. Uh, it's like that, you know. <laughs> Can't do anything about it. Okay, you just learned. Oh, I'm not sure I can deal with these tears. Like. can say that like you won a battle but you lost a king I'm surprised you know that no one is wearing black or is dead did you say to your mother what you did you she knows she knows that he's dead but maybe not how oh. he's right there he can I thought about it earlier but really is he alive his grace remains with us for the moment really oh I thought that he was dead dead he is dying Oh, I meant, now I'm really wondering Were you gonna finish your job? Oh, of his face Someone will have to rule in his stead I could never doubt your capability or your quickness of mind But? It is merely that the gentler sex heretofore has not been much privy to the strategies of battle or their execution. Cut is dick for me. You've seen no more battles than Just to prove him that your sex is doesn't mean anything. I'm being tired of this case. Send to Maiden Pool and to crack your point. Let them man their garrisons and give them stores or weapons if they find them wanting. If Colbus uses campaign, our allies must be. We must answer Brooks rest. Dusting them. They are lost already. If Aegon is dead, we will soon know it. It would be a victory in name only. It will soon prop up another is. Any time is right. Then I myself must do it. My queen, you are the crown. It's out of the question. Put what would you have me do? To send someone else? Who now? Where are you going? Town Hall. To treat with Damon. Uh -huh. And you think you will tame him? And the queen herself could not. My mother gladly sent you away to scout, to fight, humiliating me. She feels it air. Yes, she was protecting you. the succession. Hmm? I must be seen to act for her claim and mine. I can sit still no longer. I must act. The friends. They control the crossing with the twins. Start south. Just their name, I'm really like, she can we trust them? Do we want to do things with the phrase? Choose 
spy. Ah? I did not think they would be so eager to die. <laughs> they made their choice. You should have indulged them. I need them alive. No. So you're not going to go to kill them? For generations. To kill them? They are pig-headed, intransigent. They would rather burn and succumb. Hmm. That brave. Exactly the kind of men I need. It may yet be possible, I think, for those of us to achieve our ends. We have fought them for an agent more. Then perhaps you could try less fighting and more. Persuade him. They are unyielding in battle. But every man has a weakness. There are things the crown itself must not be seen to do. Show them your worst. I am your servant, your grace. You can't do it yourself. They speak around me, or to me. You're talking to her. Uh, queen, but they wish to keep me here, confined. They betray their own smallness. I do not know my part, Miss Iris. No, oh, that picture is so good. Cross I walk as I have been trod. Parading a dragon's head through the streets like a prize of war. But the people see an ill omen. Yes, it's all right. The poor whispers tear down stone. Break shields. She's do talking about estimate your subjects. You want if to you do something to sneaky inside? To the discontented, rumors are feed. What you cannot do, let others do for you. There is more than one way to fight a war. And that's what Damon said, you know, about let other people you know, do the things for, for him, you know, he can't dirty his hands. What about that? Ah, you're sounding ah. to you was beyond everything. You are very like her in some ways. No, don't say that. I'm gonna roll yeah, and connect cool. with her now just because you That's said fine. that. It can't be great for me. She gives us to your grandson. What's it said? I do wish to stand alone. You are always the strong one, the fearless dragon rider. If only you'd been born first. Blood My in your hands. Son. Your mother? It's the dark not to your night in your bread. Fucking your own mother with blood on your hands. We're drawing water from the kitchens and lighting the forges. Very well. That is merely the beginning, of course. Is there any gold left in your coffers? Enough to keep this small establishment, you see, fed and warm. I rather thought your grace as Emerson to the Queen. Perhaps she could provide the necessary coin if you could only write to her. No. And clearly, you didn't understand him well. It has been a few times that we're talking about you money them blocking the them. King. What would you call the husband of the queen? Well, oh, the king. There it is then. Consul. The last bit seems unnecessary, don't you think? The armor Are you beginning to understand finally? The king cannot ruin his sleep. The realm will notice his absence. But now he must name a region to take his place. Until he recovers. You, my queen, you! Or is not. I myself said this royal man will not pass to us again. You played your part admirably in a time of peace, your grace, but circumstances have changed. Because a queen, a woman, can't roll in a time of war? Oh, you're gonna have the same speech. It is experience that offers the surest path to 
the security queen, Alison Bailey, shouldered the duties of the role. Experience is valuable, yes, but the Dowager Queen's a woman. I'm no stranger to rule or to sitting in this council. Eamon is a fearsome drama writer, his skill is best employed in the field, but my experience is needed here, at this table. No offence was meant to grace at a time when we must show strength. Lord Barris. And a woman can't show strength according to you. What would you say in response to a most crying and very stubborn woman of our own? At least his reason is logical, you know, he has a logic. Yeah, it is the next in line. It must be him. Oh, no, it's not a surprise. A He's working with Amond. Uh... Hide your pride. All of what she did for that at the end. She's even afraid of what he can do. You know what she said to Rhaenyra about him? 